People who lost everything in Hurricane Debbie are battling a new flood of concerns tonight. Good evening, I'm Jennifer Lee. And I'm Keith Kate. Thank you for joining us. People are wondering who they can trust to help with repairs. News Channel H's Nicole Rogers in Sarasota County with some 8 on your side advice. You can see people's lives are just sitting in their front lawns. But imagine getting offer after offer from people saying they can come to the rescue. Who can you trust? That's the question we're getting answers to tonight. How many of these so-called storm chasers do you think you've seen so far? Oh, there's the, we're day in and day out. From business cards left on your mailbox to signs propped up in your front lawn, and of course the people going door to door wanting your money. The people who live in the Laurel Meadows community in Sarasota County who already lost everything in the floodwaters are facing a new concern contractor offers there's not only the pressure of people coming at our doors and saying that oh like you're gonna have to pay for this this and this it's also oh if you don't do it now one you're gonna be behind all these people and two there's so much mold and so much more worse to come neighbors say there are just too many decisions and not enough time saying each day there's another person at their door wanting money there's some people that are going around the neighborhood and uh trying to tell people that they're their fema uh claims adjusters and getting them to sign a paper saying that they'll get the 10 percent basically of whatever their fema claim is so how do you know who you can trust these people feel like your savior but the next thing you know they're taking your money and they're not doing the work that you required we took your concerns to the better business bureau to see what red flags you should be looking out for is you really have to be careful of people coming to your house knocking on your door saying they can save you they have all these fancy scenarios and they're wanting you to pay cash up front. Ask, what is your company's name? How are you filed with the state of Florida? Where are you physically located? And then you have to go and verify that information and make sure it's true. And if you take a look, this is the Better Business Bureau's website. You can see they have a Florida hurricane guide. And if you scroll down, you can click here to get quotes from businesses that you at least know have been vetted. This is just a start to making sure you're working with companies you can trust. In Sarasota County, Nicole Rogers, 8 on your side.